This is Kuhn Cassius for IFL TV. We're at a press conference here for the October 12th Riyadh season show. Artur Batebiev against Dimitri Bivol. Delighted to be joined by Artur. How are you, first of all? I'm good, thank you. How yeah. are you? How are you enjoying London? Oh, London is uh, always good. The fight was supposed to have happened before, but now it's rescheduled for October 12th? Yeah, yeah, it's a good time because that time I injured my knee. Now is uh, it's good. Um, we're, we're getting ready. What do you think about Dimitri Bivol as a fighter? You rate him? You know he's he's good good boxer. He's uh, has good experience in amateur in professional. He holding one belt like I respect him like all all my previous opponents. You know. You have the best knockout percentage as a professional boxer now. You know, 20 fights, 20 knockout wins. Are you confident you can knock out Dimitri Bivol? You know, I never uh, think about knockout in during the fight or before fight. Like, it's, if it's come, it's come. It's not, not no problem. Uh, important uh, to do, uh, to prepare this fight very well. So because you've knocked out all your opponents, if you don't knock opponents out, you're not bothered or...? Of course not, because I'm never focused on knock him out someone. What does it mean to you to become undisputed world champion? You know, it's the biggest thing in, in, uh, in professional boxing. It's, it's top of, it's goal of uh, professional boxing. It's biggest fight for me. I'm exciting. I'm really uh, want to win this fight. Uh, Arthur, let me ask you, you've faced three Brits in your career, Callum Johnson, Anthony Yard, and more recently, Callum Smith. Who was the most difficult fight for you? Um, you know, it's, <laughs> it's different, it's different. I think it's they, them, all them, all of them, they did good fights with me. And they prepared very well. I think so. You can't pick one of the three that gave you harder fight? I can pick one one of them. We know obviously this is a huge card on October the twelfth in Saudi Arabia and you're focused completely on Dimitri Bivol. But is there a plan for you to move up to Cruiserweight? There's talk about Jay Opataya and all these guys at Cruiserweight. Could we see you at Cruiserweight at some point in the next 12 months? It could be, but uh, you know, let's let's talk about this after fight. After fight. Your fight? Yeah. After. After fight. Let's yes. talk about after fight. Correct. Yes. Okay, that's fair enough. Last question. Did you watch the heavyweight fight between Anthony Joshua and Daniel Dubois? Uh, I, I, I watched not all fight, but highlights I watched there. Uh, what did you think? But you know it's it's heavyweight always like this like there is one punch can change all scenario you know absolutely heavyweight boxing is like that but um you're proud to be part of Riyadh season obviously Turkey LL Sheikh putting on these great shows in the UK and also in America and also in Saudi Arabia so you're proud to be a part of that of course of course he do very good uh, job very good things for boxing all of I love them. Okay, Arthur, thank you very much for your time. God bless. We wish you the best of luck on October the 12th.